Hi guys, welcome back. Here's another awesome video for you. But before that, hit the subscribe button and support us. So today's video is on the top 5 best camouflage that can be commonly found in a normal garden. At the 5th of our list, we have the bush cricket. They exhibit mimicry or camouflage commonly with shapes and colors similar to leaves. Their size can range from 5 mm to 130 mm and they can be distinguished from a grasshopper by its antenna which exceeds their own body length. The lifespan of this creature is about an year. The females lay eggs beneath the soil surface or in plant stem holes. Nymphs may either look like a smaller version of the adults or mimic as a spider or as a sin bug. At fourth place, we have the crab spider. It is also known as the flower spider. It is called a crab spider due to the resemblance of a crab in the way they hold their front pair of legs and their ability to scuttle sideways or backwards. They produce silk lines for drop lines. They do not build webs to trap their prey and they are ambush predators. They sit on flowers or fruit to grab their prey. They can also change colors to match whichever flower they are on at the moment. Coming in third, we have the mantis. They have triangular shaped heads with bulging eyes supported on flexible neck. They have four legs adopted to catch and grip on their prey. Moths, crickets, grasshoppers and flies are usually the victims of this creature. It watches intently as any prey such as a fly passes by waiting for the best moment to attack. At second place, we have the bagworm. They are also known as case moths because they build small protective cases to hide themselves. These cases can be made from sand, soil or plant materials. The bagworms attach these cases to rocks, trees or fences during their resting stage or even their larva stage. The bagworms usually feed on green leaves. However, in some cases, they can also be serious pests. Finally, at the top we have the yellow waxtail. This is a medium-sized damselfly with yellow-green eyes. These are very narrow in size and are difficult to spot. This adaptation is common in all damsel flies. All damsel flies are carnivorous and feed on small insects. They usually live in a variety of freshwater habitats such as ponds, lakes and rivers. This particular species can commonly be found in South Asian countries. So, which of these was your favorite? Let us know in the comment section. Also check out ISAP Math for an awesome learning experience. Find the link in the description below. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching and remember to like, comment and subscribe.